Hi, my name is Mitch, and I'm the founder and CEO here at Join It. This is my favorite video we're gonna do all year. I'm gonna go over our top innovations in membership software. In 2023, we released over 200 versions of our software. This included optimizations to existing features or performance improvements. But don't worry, I'm not gonna go over all 200 releases. I've narrowed it down to our top five. Let's dig in. First up, in no particular order, is our brand new native integration into Google Wallet. Since we first launched digital membership cards in 2020, it's it's become one of our most popular features. But this feature was originally built with iPhones in mind. While it was always Android compatible, Android users always felt like second class citizens because you had to download another app. No longer. Now we have a native integration with Google Wallet. This means it matches that seamless experience that we've always had on iPhone. Your members can add digital membership cards to their Google Wallet in just one click. And when the membership record is updated, it instantly pushes to update the card in Google Wallet. The second innovation that we made this year was adding comments to every single membership record. The idea for the comments feature came from us observing our current customers and how they use the notes field. So now we improved on that. Now when someone makes a comment, you can see which org admin made the comment and a timestamp to see when the comment was made. And then we put those in chronological order. Even better, we aggregate these comments on your dashboard. So you get a full view of all the comments happening across your member database. Speaking of dashboards, let's move on to the third innovation of the year, new charts and metrics. Now right in your dashboard, we show you your latest membership growth metrics and you can navigate to the metrics tab to go even more in depth. On this tab, you'll find metrics broken down by month for active memberships, new memberships, renewed memberships, and churned memberships. A lot of these improvements came from a brand new reporting engine that's the foundation for these charts. We have an ambitious roadmap in 2024 in terms of charts and metrics, so if you just take a moment right now to subscribe to this channel, you'll be the first to hear about them. In number four, we're staying in the domain of insights. We're moving to new and improved reports and exports. On the new side, we added a brand new report for Eventbrite. We're calling this the Event Orders Report. The Eventbrite integration is one of our most popular features. And this report marries your membership data with your ticket or order activity from Eventbrite. Also earlier in the year, we added a brand new cluster of reports around check-ins. So now you can run custom reports on check-ins in the same way that you already could around memberships and payments. And most recently, we improved all of our membership reports by adding a new column for renewals. Now, when you export any membership report, you can choose to include a column of data that shows the renewals for that specific membership. And as a teaser, we just released a brand new report where you can export a membership report by querying on renewal date. This is a powerful feature and one that's been requested quite a bit. Our commitment to our customers is we wanna make your reporting and insights dead simple and yet still very powerful. And with these releases, we've really leaned into that promise. And fifth, and last but certainly not least place is our brand new search experience. My colleagues will tell you I could talk about this for hours, but I promise I won't. The quick summary is that we've completely revamped the underlying search engine and the user experience. In new search, we've unlocked way more fields for you to search off of. Also, it returns five times quicker than our old search. And lastly, we've improved the user experience based on your feedback. So now you can execute a query and preserve the results by opening a new tab to the membership record. Also, we added shortcuts so you can go directly to sending an email or adding a payment, and this saves you clicks. And that wraps up our top five, but I have a bonus in the form of honorable mention. Last year, we made a ton of improvements to our unique group registration feature. In previous years, group memberships represented less than 1% of our total quantity. In 2023, that number jumped up to 5% of total memberships were groups. Based on this growth, we've invested a ton of resources into improving the user experience and functionality around our unique groups feature. This includes a new renewal checkout specifically for groups. In addition to other improvements, your group owner can select whether they want all group members to receive a notification or just them. There's also new tools for organization admins in your dashboard. On this new group dashboard, you can do things like update the status for all group members, or you can update the membership type for the entire group, or you can add new or existing membership records to this group. But probably the biggest thing we did for groups feature was that we improved the underlying infrastructure of our groups. So you're gonna see a lot more improvements come to this unique feature in 2024. And that's it, our top innovations for 2023. Looking forward to 2024, we have more teammates and more resources. So we put together an ambitious roadmap that we're gonna execute on for you, our customer. So I'd love for you to follow along by subscribing to this channel and I'll see you on the next video.